Hi, welcome to the Mohua Show. My name is Mohua Chinappa and I am an author, entrepreneur and ex-housewife. This podcast is about everything from business to technology to arts to lifestyle but done and spoken imandari se. Hi, in today's episode, we have a special treat for you. We are joined by Nilima Singh and Vinita Ehlawat, the dynamic duo behind FC Fettle Crave, a nutrition and wellness company that is changing the game in the industry. These two women have a combined experience of over a decade in the field of nutrition and wellness, but their journey to becoming experts in the field is not just about education, but also about personal transformation. They both made the decision to change their lifestyle and improve their own health. And in the process, they discovered a passion for, for helping others do the same how wonderful is that so with fc fettle crave they are on a mission to empower people to take control of their health and achieve sustainable wellness sustainable wellness is the keyword very few of us can manage sustainably to remain healthy and keep on the wellness track because most of us fall off in between but fc kettle does this they understand the importance of tailoring nutrition advice to the individual again very very important and their team of qualified nutrition coaches are dedicated to helping clients achieve their health goals in a realistic and sustainable way and as a company run by female entrepreneurs we know of course that's going to be successful and with a majority female workforce they are proving that women can succeed in any field they set their minds to we have no doubts about that so stay tuned as we dive deeper into the world of fc fettle crave and the inspiring story of nilima and vinita so welcome nilima first we begin with your questions and then we are going to go to vinita so nilima the first question that comes to me is that tell us about your personal journey and how did it lead to the formation of FC Fetal Crave? Hi Mohua and first of all I would like to thank you for you know considering worthy enough to give us this opportunity and to let us pour our hearts out so that you know maybe we could inspire a bunch of women at least out there. So uh, you know after completing my economics honors and MBA in finance I started working in a multinational. So it was a Monday 9 to 6 kind of a job. But there was always something going inside my head that, you know, this is not what I wanted to do. Bachpan se hi matlab aisa kuch tha ki mein, you know, I do something wherein I could help people. But wo kya tha, I had, you know, no idea about it. So, but, you know, after having my daughter and my own struggle to lose weight, I developed an interest in the relationship between food and your body. For all these years, we've been listening ki patla rehna hai to kam khana hai. Or zyada khaoge to mota ho jaoge. But you know, aisa nahi hai. This is not how our body works. And then I started getting deep into science and I realized that so many wrong practices are being followed. People are being taught wrong by a bunch of quasi-nutrition coaches. It is then that we came up with this thought that you know we need more educated and more qualified people in the nutrition industry who give logical and adaptable eating guidance to people. And and the focus should shift from losing fat to getting more healthy. Because if, you know, if you're healthy, your weight would automatically be at an ideal level. So Nilima, this is a very treacherous road. I mean, being healthy and being, um, you know, not looking at it from the fat perspective is not something I think the world is really geared to look at. Considering as a bombardment, hota hai hume, you know, of all sorts of advertising, films and, you know, models. And, you know, you go into a store, most of the clothes that you would really want to wear are all built for a model body size. And yes, today there is a company called Bliss Club that I'm a big fan of. And I, you know, where they have track pants and they have, uh, you know, sports and fitness gear, which is for the bigger women, right? You know, I'm very fascinated to understand, you know, what set me talking to you is this, is the sustainability part. Because many people who are starting dieting, they say that they are quasi-nutritionists who come and 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 say that they are challenge hai, you know, ye, mere khayal se, you faced post-pregnancy and then you were motivated to pursue a career in nutrition. So, thoda sa, humare sunne wale ko aap batayein ki ye, kis tarikhe se, ye jo ek mental game hai humare saath aur saath mein health ko optimum rakhna hai, kaise is cheez se hum manage kare is challenge ko? You know, Mowa, being a woman, you are going to be body shamed. Patle ho, to log bolenge ki kuch nahi khate ho, kya, kaisi halat ho gaya, mote hai, to bhi bolenge. So, I think a women body is meant to be body shamed in some or the other way. But you know, what happened with me was, 
यू नो आफ्टर अ ईयर ऑफ गेटिंग मैरिड जैसे कोई भी मिडिल क्लास फैमिली की एक्सपेक्टेशन होती है कि यू नो गो हैव अ बेबी नाउ सो ऑल दैट स्टार्टेड आफ्टर अयर ऑफ गेटिंग मैरिड बट आई वॉज एंट रियली रेडी फॉर इट बिकॉज मुझे ऐसा लगता था कि आई हैवेंट अचीव वॉट आई वॉन्टेड टू मे बी आई वॉज एंट अर्निंग इनफ आई थॉट एंड मे बी आई वॉज एंट रेडी फॉर अ बेबी नाउ बट देन आई वॉज टोल्ड कि बच्चे तो रिक्शा वाले भी पैदा कर लेते हैं और पाल ही लेते हैं तो तुम तो फिर भी ठीक ठाक कमा लेते हो एंड कमिंग फ्रॉम अ मिडिल क्लास फैमिली ऐसा भी मैंने सुना कि काम नहीं भी करोगे सो यूर ऑफ वेमेन काम नहीं भी करोगे तो चलेगा पति कमा तो रहा ही है and you know that in an indian household it is not easy to work but in the middle of all this chaos i gave birth to my daughter and then things changed working became even more difficult for me i was constantly running the entire day and i always felt exhausted i had no energy since beginning of the day itself my work was hampered in office also you know i was started being considered as an inefficient employee but i never knew that i was never inefficient and the the changing point in my life was when mere daughter hone ke baad after around 7 months of my uh, maternity leave when i joined office i was looking i don't know how i was looked at but people started you know some of the people they didn't even recognize me they were like are you the same uh, neelima jisko hum daughter hone se pehle mile the i looked so different यू नो आई स्टॉप वेयरिंग वेस्टर्न क्लोथ बिकॉज मुझे ऐसा लगता था कि लोग बोलेंगे कि जीन्स पहनोगी तो फट जाओगी दीज वर लिटरली सम ऑफ द थिंग्स विच पीपल वर टॉकिंग एट माई बैक एंड जॉब मुझसे इट वॉज गेटिंग डिफिकल्ट फॉर मी टू यू नो वर्क घर मैनेज करना बाहर मैनेज करना ऊपर से ये सब टॉन्ट्स फ्रॉम यू नो विच आई वॉज हियरिंग एट द बैक ऑफ माई सेल्फ सो वॉट आई डेड वॉज आई आई जस्ट क्विट माई जॉब i was somehow not able to balance everything so you know i just decided that i think i should just leave my job sit at home aur bachcha hi pal lu mujhe laga shayad wohi main kar sakti hu but you know since childhood i was always an ambitious girl my father had been my motivating guide throughout he is the encouragement of my life he told me ki ab ab kahan gaya tumhara ambition and that women are known for balancing both home and work and you can also do it so why why do you want to quit why do you want to you know just be a housewife and then you know with the support of my father and my husband i lifted myself up again i studied i uh, applied that knowledge on my own body transformed myself completed my education about nutrition science and here i am you know learning each day and preaching what i've learned to more people so that you know more women and more men also can get empowered and maybe they are not body shamed and you know not not only for being body shamed your size is not only matlab uh, mote ho to theek hai body shaming to ho hi rahi hai but it is making you unhealthy also to kisi aur ke body shaming taunts ko na suno uski wajah se nahi but you know you need to be healthy you need to be fit so that you your body is disease free so so that that's what motivated me to you know change myself and then this is what i want to you know preach and uh, yes this is how i want to pursue my career this was so heartfelt i'm just so completely enamored with the way you spoken about this so aap thoda sa mujhe apne future plans aur goals ke bare bataye fc fettle crave ke bare ki how do you see the company growing and evolving in the coming years since uh, you mentioned in the beginning that it's a women led company and we've been uh, hiring more and more women nutritionists so we continue to uh, hire more women nutritionists Not, nothing no bad feelings against men but yes we want to encourage more women kyunki see if if i uh, talk from business point of view i believe and i feel that women are more loyal maybe i mean that's that's my personal belief and uh, you know jab ek aurat ghar mein apne kaam ko chhod ke bahar aati hai so us usko bahut sari cheeze expect uski uski expectations hi alag hoti hai when she comes uh, leaving her husband or leaving her daughter or you know maybe a boy at home wo bahar aati hai to uski मल्टीपल थॉट्स होते हैं एक कि उसको पैसे कमाने हैं दूसरा उसको एक ऐसा वर्किंग एनवायरनमेंट मिले कि वो अपने सारे प्रॉब्लम्स भूल जाए हर विमेन को कुछ ना कुछ प्रॉब्लम है घर में मे बी पर्सनल मे बी फिजिकल और मे बी यू नो एनी एनी अदर थिंग सो वी बिलीव कि हम उनको एक ऐसा एनवायरमेंट भी दें सो दैट यू नो वी एज अ कंपनी ऑल्सो ग्रो एंड मे बी इवन इफ आई कुड हेल्प टेन विमेन ग्रो आई आई वुड फील दैट दैट इज वॉट आई अचीव 
and fetal crave aims at uh, empowering women and empowering every uh, every person who wants to move towards a healthy lifestyle giving them knowledge giving them education giving them enough information so that they can sustain that healthy level towards which we've taken them to that that's what uh, uh, our aim is how amazing nilma nilma but uh, ek thoda sa hamare sunne walon ke liye bataye ki how do you handle cravings kyunki jab craving hoti hai na tab to man nahi karta wo apple khane ke liye ya koi ek healthy fruit craving jab hota hai to tab ban karte hai apne fridge ko raid karo jo jo khana aapko khana nahi chahiye to isko kis tarike se manage kiya jaye very rightly saying this yes cravings are a tough uh, thing to combat and but you know maua cravings occur only when our hunger and satiety hormones aren't working well so you know it all boils down to the activity of hormones in your body we have hunger hormone which tells us ki ek andar se awaaz aati hai ki acha abhi bhook lagi hai kuch kha lo so it's nothing but a hormone which is you know echoing from inside ki abhi kuch kha lo and then there is a satiety hormone which tells us that acha theek hai abhi we are full so you should stop eating now so cravings occur only when these hormones aren't working well if you limit your food intake or you're not eating right then cravings will definitely occur So you know what I do is I make saturated fats a regular part of my meals so I feel satiated in terms of my food and you know I don't have cravings I really don't have any cravings then so it's about how you know what all uh, incorporations you do in your daily meals that is what is going to decide whether you crave or you don't can you just explain for our listeners what do you mean by saturated fats so by saturated fats i mean uh, the the pure form of fats you know namely ghee butter coconut oil fresh cream cheese ghar ka hua ghar ka bana hua makhan is also a part of saturated fats so you know if your meals are full of fats you will be able to go for at least 2 to 3 hours without any cravings how do you handle social situations that may involve unhealthy food and uh, you know drinking options bahut baar aisa dekha jata hai ki aap ek diet mein ho par aapko koi na koi ek important function aa hi jata hai aur wahan pe ja ke you know hum log kai lete to what is it that people need to do the next day so iske liye mere paas ek hi jawab hai n o no or no sirf ek shabd hi nahi in itself it is, it is a complete sentence so you know you have to learn to say no and you know if you know that something is going to harm your body then why do you even want to have it so it's all about mind game see in terms of food so if if i tell you that you're going to a wedding so there are multiple options and we teach our clients that what is good and what is which food is going to cause what effect to your body so mere jo clients hain unko pata hai ki out of a bunch of food items that you have what all he should choose or what all he or she shouldn't choose so unko pata hai but you know there are some people agar उनको ऐसा लगता है दैट यू नो बाय होल्डिंग अ ग्लास ऑफ वाइन इट डजेंट रियली मेक यू अ पार्ट ऑफ दैट सर्कल सो इट्स अगेन इट्स ऑल अबाउट माइंड गेम इट्स अबाउट हु यू आर व्हिच मेक्स यू अ पार्ट ऑफ दैट सोशल गैदरिंग एंड नॉट वेदर यू आर टेकिंग पार्ट ऑफ दैट ड्रिंकिंग ऑप्शन और नॉट सो इट इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन इट इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन यू एंड वॉट यू चूज फॉर योर सेल्फ सो यू शुड लर्न टू से नो इन इन दैट केस सो वेल हियर इज फॉर आर लिस्नर्स Uh, the word and the sentence is no from nilima which is it easy <laughs> but yes i shall also incorporate the word no on a more regular basis after listening to you let's now just move to vinita elawat vinita aapke sath sabse pehla sawal mera hai can you tell us a little about your background and how you became interested in the field of nutrition hi mahua it's been pleasure talking to you and would really appreciate for providing this opportunity to discuss about nutrition and how i started my journey in this field after completing my masters and serving in various companies i always felt ki kuch to life mein aisa kare jo sabke favor mein ho aur aap society ko serve kar sake luckily i live in a family where everyone is concerned about health and can give priority to their fitness aur yahi se start hoti hai meri nutrition journey kyunki fitness is incomplete in absence of nutrition so instead of partially implementing something in my life I decided to grab all the knowledge and corona period provided me that opportunity to complete my education in the field of nutrition. Amazing. Now just tell me a little bit about Fetal Crave. How is it different from other nutrition companies? Uh, well, Mawa, aap kuch bhi achieve kare, but success enjoy karne ke liye health ka sahi hona sabse zyada important hai. And Fetal Crave believes that nutrition is not a day need, it's a part of life. So we really focus on structural need of a human being. of a human being because then we feed our body what it actually requires rather than experimenting any crash courses 
our next motive is to educate our client so that they get sustainable results and finally that is what matters a lot we also want to know a little bit about the success you've seen with your clients and how do you measure you know progress and success success is when your client says ki vinita tumne hame life ka wo mantra sikhaya ki hum har din enjoy karte hain aur tumhe thanks karte hain and we measure progress when client says i love you because my thyroid is cured you know and that's what like happened with me also one of my client uh, she called me up one day and she told me this thing ki vinita ya to maine apne husband ko love you bola hai ya aaj main aapko ye word bol rahi hu and the reason is my thyroid is cured and i'm you know completely you know jo ek trauma rehta hai ki nahi abhi mujhe life bhar pills ke sath rehna padega so i am out of this trauma सो so, मेरे को एक सवाल जो आता है ना आपके जो एक्सपीरियंस एज ए फीमेल ऑन्टरप्रीन इन द हेल्थ एंड वेलनेस इंडस्ट्री कोई चैलेंजेस होती है बिकॉज ज़्यादातर इंडस्ट्रीज में देखा जाता है कि एक तो uh, औरतों के साथ निगोसिएशन बहुत आराम से लोग कर लेते हैं वेन इट कम्स टू पेइंग ऑफ फीस एंड जो और भी बहुत सारे प्रोफेशन है जहाँ पर ये निगोसिएशन होती ही नहीं है जैसे आप कोई डॉक्टर के पास जाओ या कोई इंजीनियर के पास जाओ तो उसके साथ तो कोई निगोसिएशन होता ही नहीं है फीस का बट कोई आर्टिस्ट के साथ जाओ या कोई न्यूट्रिशनिस्ट के पास जाओ हमेशा कि शायद यू नो ये ज्यादा ले रहे हैं ये एक अजीब सा माइंडसेट है और लोग बहुत बार हैगल भी करते हैं तो आप हमारे सुनने वालों को बताएं कि किस तरीके की चैलेंजेस वो फेस करेंगे इन केस कोई हमारे सुनने वालों में से न्यूट्रिशन और वेलनेस इंडस्ट्री में जाना चाहते हैं एंड व्हाट इज इट दे नीड टू कीप इन माइंड एग्री विद यू मऊआ बट होता क्या है कि यू नो यू शुड बी कॉन्फिडेंट इनफ एंड यू नो नॉलेजेबल इनफ टू डील सच काइंड ऑफ पीपल because you have invested in your education it's a kind of investment and what we actually tells our client see if you are you know uh, taking nutrition as an expense it's not an expense it's an investment if you have clinical things associated with you then it becomes an expense so being a female entrepreneur what we believe that you know it's always good to take challenges in our life otherwise the struggle is equal for a male male candidate too if knowledge is incomplete so just work on it keep updated yourself and enjoy the challenges of your life thank you so much for being in today's podcast and uh, you know before we end uh, i this is for my listeners if they want to get in touch with you which includes me to get into their um, space where they feel more energetic healthier and probably want to fit into that same jeans that they felt that they uh, would want to wear we don't know what would be that uh, trigger that gets a person to get down to adopting a completely healthy lifestyle jo bilkul bhi aasan to hota nahi hai and um, how do they get in touch with you so uh, mowa we are available on instagram our uh, website is active uh, by the name of fcfettlegrave.in so we are available our contact numbers are there so you know maybe they could ping us on instagram they could ping us through our website channel or you know if somebody would like to just come and see they can meet us in our uh, gurgaon office the address is right there on our website and uh, our numbers are also there on the website if you know somebody wants to just get in touch with us and another uh, good news for our uh, you know listeners is that soon we would be launching our app and food services soon so that we can give a complete solution to our clients so i'm the first one who's going to sign up because i will be in delhi for 20 days <laughs> in the month of february so that i come back to bangalore totally you know in in a new shape transformed mohua transformed mohua absolutely bang on to that and thank you so much for being on today's podcast thank you thank you so much thank you mohua to you our dearest listeners you can find us on your favorite streaming services spotify amazon music apple podcast and of course on all other major streaming services with loads of love we are the mohua show where we talk imandari se <laughs>